Yo, Cape Town, done. Been there, done that. Got the t-shirt. And it's very beautiful, I think, you know, because the little birds are still flying. So schaut der indische Ozean aus, wenn Glasplatte ist. Nicht viel los in der Hose. Yes, there is no Christmas tree around here <laughs> and no Christmas decoration actually. It slowly gets to the point where I know the boat good enough to not be nervous anymore and uh, that makes everything a lot more joyful. Australian. You, you're just just about to cross the line. So welcome to uh, Kingston Beach, Tasmania, uh, Michael. <laughs> Good to see you. So okay, now to the serious stuff. You're halfway. You're heading home now. So how's that feel? Oh, that's good. <laughs> that's very good. I'm actually very happy yeah. that this, the Earth has the size it has. Yeah. It doesn't need to be bigger. It's big enough. <laughs> Michael, it's your first time in the Southern Ocean. How does it feel? Uh, very good. <laughs> It is in the same in the same way. It is very beautiful and very terrible. <laughs> it doesn't stop, you know. It's, it's it's really crazy. It's a lot of motion and it never stops. You said in Cape Town you are super scared to to go into the Southern Ocean. You are happy to go and scared. At the end, it, it, no. It, actually, I think it, I, I've done the proper training. I tell you, I've seen all this. What I've seen now in the Northern Atlantic already in winter. Mm. It was not there was nothing really shocking mm. and uh, for 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 the weather warning you know for the big system which i had yeah eight meters swell from southwest beautiful mm. it's nice to look at it's super nice to sail mm. on yeah. when we were here in hobart four years ago for the previous ggr the skippers were super tired suffering a lot in the boat from the humidity from the loneliness from all this long way and you look kind of okay <laughs> <laughs> is is that because you are proud to be four in the race or or why you are not complaining <laughs> well the complaining does not make any sense so it doesn't make any difference if you complain it just makes the day harder somehow <laughs> 
uh, I think the guys last time had a lot worse weather than we had, mm. so they had a lot more work to do. Mm. Uh, and uh, you know, it's it's like I mean, I'm lonely at times, and uh, things get boring a bit. But uh, uh, I prepared well. I'm, I'm still happy. What, what can I say? I'm happy to be like one of the six remaining guys or seven. How many are we now? Yeah. <laughs> so now it's uh, heading home and Cape Horn and all that sort of stuff. Are you excited? Are you sort of uh, apprehensive? Uh, you know, where's the emotion? Uh, you know, I had some waypoints. We did some videos of waypoints, which I yeah. thought will be my kind of next goal stuff. Uh, it turned out that it's Sunday. You know, Sunday is new food box. Sunday is a new dot in my uh, chart 4000, which is the world. So I do yeah. every Sunday one point, how far I got. And it's kind of celebrating day and it's kind of working from Sunday to Sunday. And yeah. I do not work hard on Sunday, you know, I do a Sunday on Sunday. It's like a, a reef more than necessary. I do not uh, go out on deck during night and stuff. I, I give myself a Sunday on Sunday, like other people do. <laughs> yeah. yeah <laughs> it's yeah. not always possible, of course. You know, if the boat needs something, I do it. That, that's for sure. Yeah. Uh, but you can, you can say uh, uh, more active or more inactive. Sunday is the inactive day. <laughs> yeah. So, um, so you're obviously enjoying the navigation. I do. Yeah. I think it's fantastic, actually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is fantastic. It's a lot of of trusting. You know, I actually almost did the same thing as Guy de Boer. Yeah. I was like uh, half a mile off offshore, and I thought I'm like 50 miles off. Ah. Uh, okay. When was that? When I hit Lanzarote. Ah. And then I almost hit the northern part of Lanzarote, and that was that was kind of yeah, ooh. yeah. That's because cool. I was searching for a light, and I did a navigational error in terms of that I had uh, looked out for a light which I couldn't see where I was. Yeah, it's only visible from like north northwest to southeast. Yeah, and I approached from the west. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so the first error was that I did not look good enough into the chart, and then I was sitting actually there. And I see some lights, and I think, you think, why do I see lights? There shouldn't be any lights, you know. And I didn't react. <laughs> and then I saw the the light which I actually was looking for, and it was like half half a mile. Yeah. Five k maybe. Okay. Hey. And, um, uh, then I didn't sleep for like two nights or so. <laughs> what's it What's it like living with your bushy friend? With this one? Yeah. This one is going off. Eh? Yeah, the Pacific gets a new one. It's, it's, that's, that's a, how, how many uh, weeks or months? There's a bit, this bit is more equator, than This is the equator here. Eh? That's the equator. Uh -huh. Yeah, actually, yeah, yeah okay. Mm -hmm. uh, you know. It's warm. It's lovely, I tell you. And it's soft. <laughs> yeah. Can you keep a snack in there, you know, sort of breakfast or something? Yeah, or that's really the point, that, that it takes a lot of water to, to keep it kind of... Nice and easy. Yeah, it's okay. We're upwind. It's all right. How are you with the water? Do you have enough? Uh, yes, yes and no. Yeah, I do. I have now 135 or so. My, no, the water in the tank is contaminated. I lost like 150 liters or so. Oh, really? Is so you're boiling that? it or you have to throw it or you use it for washing or whatever? I use it for washing and toothbrushing and stuff, but it's, yeah. it's getting more and more salty. Uh, I'm going to kind of... Uh, seal both of the of the things when I'm here now. I just do them with with, with yeah. cigar or something, yeah. really mocking water tight. And uh, I may I might empty the tank kind of slowly, and as soon as it's empty, start to fill up again. Yeah. But then, yeah, I, I do still have 125 cans of lemon soda. Lemon soda, yeah. soft drink. Yeah. Yeah. So well, that's, that, that's right. another 30 liters of, to drink, yeah. you know, liquid. <laughs> <laughs> I do carry like seven bottles of red wine still ah. and two ah. bottles of rosé wine. Oh, it's another 10 liter bar. liquid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> no, cool. That, I think it's, going, it's fine. It, the, the thing is that I've been told that it's not possible to collect water in the tropics and it's much easier down here and it's exactly the other way around yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. and the tropics are collected like 50 liters in an hour or in two hours or something like one big square kind yeah. of filled up everything yeah and down here it's like a drizzling and then you always have like six meter seas and a lot of wind and yeah, 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 sails. yeah yeah absolutely absolutely so what what's what's been the best part to date from from the sub to here 
I, I, I don't know. It's I think you know it's it's the whole thing. Yeah. There is not one best part somehow. Probably the animals. Animals. Seeing all these elements. Yeah. And again and again. But yeah. uh, it's a whole thing, story somehow. Yeah. And and what are you looking forward to most now? Uh, like getting not back in, not to the today. Summer. I mean, oh, breakfast. Having yeah. having rounded Cape Four and get back to the Lesotho. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>